Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to make a remote control car using the remote connection sender and receiver blocks in my scripted objects and remote logic mod. The first thing you're going to do is make a car of course. So um, let's get this right here. Get some back wheels. And some steering. We're gonna use double bearings for the steering, and I'll explain why in a second. So like this, like this, like this. So we now have a car. This is double bearing steering. Hmm, what will we need? An engine. Let's put that up. Bearing like that. And now for steering, we're gonna use two controllers. Um, one for going to the left and one for going to the right. So, for the, going to the left, going to the right. Um, and if we're going left, it has to go to plus 45, going right, then it has to go to minus 45. Um, then we'll have some logic blocks here. And I'll turn one in a second. And we have an engine. Well, this works. And let's see if this works. This also works. Can go left, can go right. Beautiful. Now, so you also need a remote control center if you want to remote control your car. So we need senders. And we're going to use four senders one for going forward, one for going backward, one for steering left, and one for steering right. So, what do we do? Um, Let's get the switch and get this set up. Now, to make sure the right signal arrives at the right place, we're gonna give each of these a different color. We're gonna give this for forward, this for backward, this for left, and this for right. And um, what that does is when you have a receiver and you have um, you have them on the same color, so left was going to be this and right was going to be that. Let's connect it. The receiver will pick up the connection from the sender with the same color. So left and right, it goes red and red and blue, blue. Um, the next step will be the power for the motor for the engine. So we need two receivers for that, a black one for forward and a white one for backwards. Well, we can't connect these at the same time, so we'll need a power combiner and this basically takes both inputs so you can have multiple inputs for one engine. So what this does is if you turn this on, well maybe we should turn our engine on, and if you turn this switch on going to give power and if you turn this switch on it's also going to give power but we want this switch to go back so what are we going to do we'll take our power direction reverser and connect it to that and then connect this to there and right now it should go backwards as you can see so the base of our car is basically done you can add other stuff such as lights doors whatever but we might want to make our remote control a little bit more comfortable because pressing switches at the time is not really, yeah, uh, it works, but it also doesn't really work that well. So we're going to use a W and S converter. Uh, the W and S converter, um, I'll show it. Then I'll show it like this. If you connect the seat to the converters, they won't give power when you press W or S, like if you go forward and the seat goes backwards. So we can use this forward and backwards and connect it to the sender. We'll have to get rid of these. So connect forward to the forward sender and backwards to the backward sender. And now if you press forward, it goes forward. Now if you go backwards, it's going to go backwards.
And the last thing is to do is steering. Well, steering doesn't really work that well with switches, so instead we're going to use the buttons. Button for going left, button for going right. And now if you press 1, it steers to the left. Right goes for 2. So you have a completely from your seat remote control car. Um, you can also uh, use instead of the buttons, you can use an A and D converter, but I don't have that in my mod yet because that's not really possible right now uh, with what I can do uh, making mods. So uh, maybe uh, I'll add that later. Um, also, if you want to race with a friend, then uh, well, you need another car, of course. So uh, C car save and RC car. Like that, um, and as you'll see, this connection disappears. That's a bug in my mod, which I will fix. But right now you have to think: okay, um, whenever I spawn a new one, connect the reverser to the uh, to the combiner, and then it works again. However, because the com uh, because the senders and receivers are the same color for both, uh, if you're going to race with your friends, you'll have to change the color of the receivers right here. So, for example, this blue, this purple, and uh, white, and dark brown, and he will have to make his own uh, his own control center uh, with the, with the same colors so like this, and like this, and then you'll see that uh, the, the this car is right. So. You will um, make sure to change the colors if you want to race with a friend because the same colors will, uh, yeah, it will mess up. Um, I hope you learned something today. Um, have fun racing. Leave likes, comments, uh, subscribe, share with friends. The mod is uh, in the description. You can download it from the workshop. It's really simple, but be sure you're in the test version because else it won't work. Thanks for watching. See you next time. Goodbye.